Hi everyone, back with some quick thoughts on my Rogue Manila Battle Ropes. Um, I've used these for, let's see, about three years now. I've had them since I bought my gym in the beginning. And uh, I've used them off and on, uh, high times probably twice a week, low times maybe once every couple months. So, uh, especially during the winter. They don't see much use because I typically have to use them outside. Um, don't want to stand outside in the rain or when it's really freaking cold. So they stay up here. A uh, couple of pros. So uh, they held together relatively well. You can see after three years, there's no real shredding or anything like that. They're not falling apart, so that's a good sign. Um, they are a killer workout, awesome for kind of finishing off the upper body, especially, uh, or combining with things like sled work or an airdyne to really just demolish yourself. Uh, you're moving blood all the way down and then all the way up and then back and forth. It's a very brutal workout style. Uh, cons of these. So, these after three years still shed. It's kind of annoying. Uh, luckily at this point I, like I said, where I attach mine is almost outside of my gym. It reaches all the way out and because of that most of the shedding happens on my driveway but uh, I would honestly have probably, if I had known that, I would have bought ones that don't shed so the newer kind of uh, black it's a different type of fiber, polyurethane, something or other. I don't believe shed, or at least don't shed as much, or I would have gotten the ones that are encased in um, some type of sleeve. So if I could do these over again, I would have done that. Two, uh, this is it's not necessarily a con, just more of, of a point to call out. The difference between having these at full extension, so these are 50 foot ropes, so standing uh, just shy of 25 feet out versus let's say 22 feet or 20 feet, so we got a little bit of slack. The difference in the resistance in the workout is night and day. So if you think you've got a 20 foot garage and you're gonna hook these up in the corner and then stand in the other corner and be able to use them, uh, probably not. So you need, need, need that full extension. Without it, they are uh, pretty much a waste of time, uh, in my opinion. So you need full extension. Get the ones that don't shed. Um, let's see, you need an anchor point, preferably not on your rack or anything, because then it makes a ton of noise, bounce all over the place. Just get a strap or something that you can hook to the wall or a post, and you're good. And then just beat the crap out of yourself and have some fun. So uh, that's about it. Thanks, guys.